Yeah, no, that can't be right. There's no way. Welcome back, guys. Yesterday, we tamed this Nian. And one of the things I had trouble with was trying to figure out what kind of saddle he used. Turns out, I looked at the picture of it and I thought to myself, huh, that's a Carno picture. So I put a Carno saddle on it. And I don't think that's right. Um, but it's on there. I, I really have no intention of using this guy. So we're probably just going to take off uh, the saddle for now. And we'll, uh, you know, walk away from him and he'll do his thing. But yeah, like I said, welcome back to, to our Talama Monsters series. It has been quite a ride with this, uh, this series. Yesterday, we killed an ogre. And then a Diorex, an HC Diorex, killed a second ogre, and then we were attacked by a third ogre. So it's it's a little nuts. Today, I think I I want to tame a better flyer. I want something that can actually fight. Dark Smoke Breath can't fight crap. He's really fast, and that's about it. And I don't use him as much as I use our Heroku, because our Heroku is just amazing for weight and everything. So that's uh, that's where I'm sitting there. And I know Pyrea has its own kind of wyvern, and that's kind of what I'm interested in right now. But yeah, also yesterday we tamed up a female... Uh, Divine Allosaurus, and we now have the availability to get 230 Divine Allosauruses. Uh, the male is raising up right now for, to go with these two females. I'll run a squad of three when I run these guys. It'll be uh, pretty powerful, I hope. I mean, I'm not gonna... I'm not gonna put all my eggs in that basket, I guess. But I believe that they should be well powerful enough to take down a balrog i haven't seen one so i haven't been too worried about it but yeah and in my spare time i did some work on the on the keep you know we got these pipes going through here now we have uh i think it's the room after this one yeah it's kitchen next room yeah we now have power well steam power um this took quite a bit to set up it wasn't easy and then we also have a steam incubator. This thing runs on a uh, steam. So, you know, you just throw out the eggs after they're 100% incubated. And we got all we get all these uh, different eggs. It's not bad. I'm going to take those ones right there. These are the last of them, so it'd be nice to get a uh 230 male to, for breeding, but I'm not too worried about it. And then I also made this. Uh, it's an industrial cropper grinder. By that I mean it's it's uh <laughs> it's basically a giant mortar and pedestal um, that pumps out stuff really fast. And then the power recycler is the actual grinder for for the whole thing. Yeah, I mean I've added a couple things, another layer to the. Uh, the turrets, I think that's what they're called. And, you know, a little bit of an entrance area. I like the uh, look of this, this copper right here. I'm using the copper more as like an accent than the actual building. So, oh, it's on my bow. But, but, but saying that, it hasn't been exactly too easy to build uh, out of copper. So, I'm thinking we need to get a new tool. I think it's... In the melee? Yeah. Me uh, the steampunk drill. Can I make one of those? Yes. I'm trying to think of what it would take to upgrade this. I think we got a couple things we can do for it. Um, I'm going to take all these diamonds. We're going to upgrade it. I'm not sure if that's going to affect uh, 
how it produces what it's supposed to do because this will actually give us copper rather than just giving us uh you know metal which we need both of them but copper uh cementing paste okay that's not a big deal I have cementing paste up the butt, I think. Why? Now there's a way to find out. Yeah, we got a little bit. I'm gonna probably have to make a run over to the cementing paste uh, store or the beaver dams, as they call them. Yeah, I didn't think that I was gonna be able to go too far with that. See what this thing looks like. What does it run on? Uses refined oil for fuel. Okay. That's not a big of a deal. Got oil right here. I think if we put right here. Right here. Fine oil. Um, it says we need hide, right? Can I make like a hundred of that? Yeah, okay. <laughs> okay. I'm sure that'll do something. I've never used this tool before. I, I don't know if it's new or what, but it's supposed to be able to get copper. Oh, wow. Oh, that's so nice. The smelted copper ore has uh, been, been like one of the hardest things to get. Oh, it's like a really good pickaxe too. Oh, that's nice. This is definitely worth it. I don't even need to upgrade it anymore. Uh, I don't want to see a point to it. That's 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 enough uh, copper ore for me. Okay, let's go throw that in. Uh, That's the one problem with those uh, railings right there. Let's look at all that. Jeez, oh, geez. There. We'll get all this going. A little bit of building stuff for the day. So I'm just wondering, like, what would probably be the best course of uh, taming one of those... Uh, one of those wonderful wyverns because I imagine it's just like taming a reg it's like trapping a regular wyvern so maybe the behemoth gate method I think I, I have to make those in here um let's make Four of them? Yeah, we can do that. We'll just need two doors. Yeah, this should, uh... I think this should work. And the question is, is, uh, what's the next one I want to... Well, what is the... Wyvern I want to tame? I see him all over the place. It's not like it's, uh... A huge deal at all. They're everywhere. Okay. Um, the next thing we need is probably some mutton. Some mutton. Kitchen. I should just probably go through the center area. It's probably faster. Um, oh crap, yeah, it's in the other fridge. Uh, that shouldn't be too big of a deal. I don't think taming one of them is going to be that hard. I don't want half of it. I think that should be fine. I don't know if they're breedable. I don't know anything about these ones. Um, there is a slight kind of a uh, wiki, I guess. But it doesn't... I don't think it has anything about these wyverns on it. Um, 
There was a poison one like right down below. It was like a 140 poison. That thing. Use your teeth. Oh, it's those flower things. And yeah, they're always all over the place over here. Yeah, um. Griffin. That rock dude's still up there that I don't think I'm gonna be able to kill anytime soon. I yeah, see there's one right there. There's a fire one, I think. Smoke breath always has a freaking level. Yeah, that's a fire wyvern. They're always such high levels, too. I don't think I've ever seen one below a level 100. So. Um. Yeah, see what I mean? They're always here. 120. Uh, I'm trying to think where we've seen some uh, ice ones before. Because I know this ice up here has stuff, but I really want to... Uh... That's, I think that's the kind I'd want, is ice ones. There's usually nothing up here. Ice is barren. So, there's another... That is a poison one. 150. See what I mean? It's, it's just... It's just pick your poison, basically. Which one you want. I'm gonna look at this ice. I'm thinking this might be where we've seen them. But, I'm not 100. Yeah. There's, yeah, there's one. There's 110. So maybe follow the ridge and we'll find a good level one? No. Stupid mana armor. Wish I wish there was modern ones, the modded ones, modern. I'd like a modern rendition on the mana armor, please. I don't see any right here either. I gotta be careful. This crap's cold. Should have brought some healing potions. I don't know if we have any left. Here's the mushroom forest. This is where I, uh, I've been uh, getting fungal wood and stuff like that. Not bad. That's, that's that's one thing we need a we need a stronger creature for is because those dralian will shred this this dragon. So I need the dralian and gems from him. Apparently. Every now and then you get one when you kill one. So. Maybe. There's just, uh. We're just rendering it in will help. That thing. Oh, it's an ice golem, but it's glacier. Hmm. That's all there is. An earth one. There's a max little lightning one. That's a thought. Hmm. Oh, there's another one. There's a 135. I know it might seem like. Might seem. A weaker of, of them all, but I'm thinking I want to go after that ice one. Okay. This is a different one. It's not the same one that we had before. Um, I tried pacifying that 135, uh, and it doesn't work. Get on him. So apparently, this is supposed to just tick down and 
over time it, it should pacify it I, I don't I just kind of read the description on the uh, thing I guess they have like the bigger they are the more of a pacification timer they have so I think at the end of this uh, this one it should freaking go so I have 900 seconds to uh, till it's tamed which is weird I guess I don't know I I've kind of expressed my feelings in other videos on this whole taming method. Um, there's a whole bunch of them up on that ridge up there, so I don't think we'll have a problem finding another one. Uh, that other one, it, you can't put stimulant into it, so I made a bunch of stimulant for nothing. Um, so, I mean, I guess I'm just going to have to sit here and wait for this crap to happen, and then, then you, get, you, start, you start the long process of uh, just feeding it. So... I'm probably gonna pump another arrow into it here just just to make sure that it happened. Does that crap? Yeah, that hurts a lot. He's he's already broken my armor. Just trying to get him in here. But yeah, it's a, it's a weird process. I think I'll just bring it back when we get close to zero on it. If this works, I, I, <laughs> this is a whole new territory for me. Okay, so I've just been sitting here pelting this thing with arrows because that's what the Discord and the guy in the Discord said to do. He said uh, it, it's not a matter of time. It's a matter of just knocking them out with the arrows. Um, but I don't have, I don't think I have enough freaking, uh, crank it. These arrows are really cool, by the way. <laughs> um, well, I have a bunch of regular ones, so, I mean, we don't have, a, we don't have a lot of blue, but. We used all of ours to knock uh, out that one. Every one of these shots kind of count. I had to get. I had to come down here and and, and start shooting him because <laughs> he. Absolute monster. Use these. This should be fine. Maybe. Yeah, we're good. We just keep shooting this one spot. He has no chance to uh, not be hit. The thing, the thing about this is, is I just had to use almost all of our soothing arrows to tame one creature. It's, it's, it's so crazy. I, I don't, I, I hopefully can take down more ogres and stuff and get a lot more, uh, potions. We just have to figure out that one hit. Nope, nope, that one hit. Cool. And yeah, we just ultimately have to hit, figure out how to uh, do it effectively. I'm thinking my squad of uh, Allosauruses should have no problem taking down any any ogre now. So just gotta get some good saddles on them and everything. Hopefully this guy will be a benefit to taking down a lot more Pyrean creatures because we need black pearls. We need everything So investment I guess there we go Oh geez, this has been nuts He broke all my armor again 
I mean, he literally broke all my armor. Yeah. No idea if there's an ogre near us. I think there was an ogre on the ridge over there. It's like something like that. It doesn't even go by levels, I don't think. I think everything goes by uh, size from what I was reading. Aryan fire wyvern. Yeah, there's the ice wyvern at 135. There's a bunch of them over here. They're very common. That's why I thought they would be a good, uh, good tame. We'll get a, we'll get a, a breeding pair. We just got to be careful with our, uh, our wyvern, I guess. Just don't let it die. <laughs> repair all my armor i'm gonna get the saddle and uh i might cage up uh these allosauruses they're all raised up now so and i'll bring you back when uh, the wyvern's up uh the wyvern disappeared off my radar that's kind of scary not gonna lie um <laughs> if it died i'm gonna be very upset be very honest. Thorntail Natter. Interesting. I think it's from uh, Harry Potter. It died. I don't know. It was like, that better not be it. Oh, it tamed. Good. Okay. I was like, is it alive? Did it wake up? What? Is is my dragon, like, the stupidest dragon ever? I'm so glad I'm getting rid of this thing. I am glad. Okay. So, I'm gonna pick up this trap. Because I'm... Well, do I want to pick up this trap? No, I'm going to leave it down here uh, because there's a whole bunch of wyverns up on that ridge up there. That makes complete sense to. Oh, man, this thing. OK, so he's out now. Let's put the door back on. What do you have on you? I nothing. Um. Take those woolly rhino horns. You never know when you don't might need them. That and the pelt. I'm probably gonna put you away and use you for emergencies. Oh my gosh. I mean, he's not as fast. That's for sure. I'm sure he hits harder though. He hits over over 200 right off the bat. He's he's definitely better. Um. Is that a natter thing? Yeah, natter. Um, wow, he already has more health. I'm gonna try to get... Um, Spino would be great to kill. Wait, d does it do a dive bomb? <gasps> oh, no way, that's so cool! Oh yeah, it already it's already way better. It's 300 damage. That's like psh, boss that's boss damaging. <laughs> There's a Dagon. There is a 150 Dagon, um but I'm not sure if uh when we'll go after that. I don't know how strong they are or what what classification they'd be in. They're really big. Yes. Okay, so we got a bunch more. Pump this. We'll have to get the saddle better, too. Because... Yeah. I don't want him to die. 
This this guy is already like way better than most other things. I'm gonna go after this yellow drop over here. I've been collecting drops and pretty much just taking them apart, destroying them, grinding them up, because we need hide. Uh oh. This is not a good place. Stay back. Yeah, that's a bad parasaur. Go after that parasaur. Was it worth it? Yeah, that hurt a lot. How much damage did I do to my armor? Yeah, I just repaired this stuff too. <laughs> I might have overreacted a little bit, but it's so scary. I do like this guy. How much? How much stamina does it have? 990. I gotta get that up to about 2,000. But like I said, this is this is kind of like our. Uh, how do you say it? This is this is like the the basement for our. What is that guy? What's a night griever? Where are you? Ah, yeah, it's bad. I should have figured it was gonna be bad. What are you from? Um, he's not from Pyria. Just gave me a bunch of clothes. <laughs> Weird. This episode is uh thought it was gonna be a lot simpler than what it what it has turned out to be. To be honest. Here's where we tame the uh Oh that breath does a lot of damage. Kill that, uh, kill that guy. I'll give this guy some levels. There we go. Definitely gonna put some into this. Of course, there's a pork fighter. It would be nice to find another orc, uh, ogre over here. There was one yesterday. Unless Smock finally finished it off. Hmm. They're usually pretty easy to find though, so... I might just... Look for one and... Kill it. Whenever we find him, we'll just have to kill him because those soothing arrows are way too expensive to uh, for me to make by my on my own. So, huh? He was around here. I don't know where he went. Is that a tiny little frost wyvern? He's only level 55. Get the stamina up to about 2,000 and then we'll, uh, talk. I think it's that.
Oh. Probably not a good idea, Pangolian Wyvern. I gotta figure out how to get black pearls. I think that's like the hardest... The, the hardest thing to uh, get at this point. Hmm. Wonder if there's any place on this map. Just go grab black pearls. Like a black pearl cave or something. I don't know. That tree by itself. Oh, the trees give you black. Oh, my God. I don't know what I was fighting, but... Oh, wait, well, not fighting that thing, that's for sure. I think, like, one hit... One of those things, one hit my dire wolf, I think. Or was that a fae? Maybe we get... Dark Berserker soul. Okay. We... Oh, we just got 300 freaking... The trees give you black pearls. That's good to know. I just thought, hey, let's kill a tree because it's on its own. Because there are, there's always like two or three of them all together. So, it's good to know. Oh, this guy's awesome. Well, I'm going to take them uh, black pearls with me. Don't have any, do we have any hide? He's already got a thousand hide. Yeah, but guys, uh, it was a good day today. This wyvern is definitely a triumph. It was definitely hard to get, and I don't think it's going to be as hard to get another one. Like I said, I, I know there's a, uh, at least a 145 or a 140 sitting on the ridge behind where our cage is. So I can just lure that in and pump it full of uh, soothing darts, soothing arrows as soon as we uh, grab them. Um, that's, I think that's the hardest thing is getting those soothing arrows right now. We gotta find flipping uh, ogres, kill them, which I don't think is gonna be hard at all to do, because when I mean, we did it yesterday with with an unbred Allosaurus, our new Allosauruses are tons better. So, um, yeah, everything's everything's coming together. Uh, yeah, this guy is just really awesome. He welcome to the team, right? <laughs> uh. Can you breed him? Yeah, it says enable wandering to breed. Enable wandering to mate. So yeah, if you enjoyed this at all, please like, comment, subscribe. I'm Icy Wolf. And I'll be seeing ya. Bye.